right now for the rest of my haul I may be doing these separately I'm not sure because I got some food items that I got from Iceland in the range other items I got from Poundland um, some are food and some non-food so this is sort of a set for a few sweets this is the non-food sort of section um, got a few bits for our granddaughter um, not everything is a pound so I'll try and remember to stipulate what the prices are we've got this range again the Crayona um, learn to draw this is the artist pad 165 stickers drawing steps for fun and learning and this was three pounds so what i've done is got a um, group of pieces together these are from her uncle actually for our granddaughter's birthday so that's the first one so that was three pounds the other three pound item is this um activity pack the same make Lots of cutting pages inside, over 200 reusable stickers, and there is the back. So we thought um, I'd concentrate on sort of educational pieces again, um, due to the fact that um, we've got uh, that, is it Leapfrog, Dallin? Yeah, Leapfrog device thing for the TV on learning. So, um, and that was 31.99 I shared that I think we got that while I was in Warwickshire so this is all sort of things I like to group things for like to you know like for like together so there's those and to go along with that we've got the dot dot activity book and I quickly had a look at this and I thought this would be um okay it says three plus and she's going to be four retails actually at 4.99 this does um, and it's a basic dot dot which I think is really good um, to learn her numbers so there we are and obviously to identify the numbers um, I'm not sure if these have got prices on that was retailing at 9.99 and that was retailing at 9.99 so um, yeah good price this was a pound this is um, the scrapbook um, with all the um, colour pages, same make again, so I can see I've made a um, sort of group and then we've got this sock puppet, if you might have seen a previous Poundland haul I bought quite a few of these different things from this make for her Christmas stocking so she's got that one and um, got this sewing kit for plus and this makes one butterfly so I think if I remember rightly, um, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I didn't think that was bad for ten pounds. All that um, and make a nice um, birthday gift for her. Um, to tell you the truth, it looks like everything's near enough for a granddaughter. I picked this one up. Um, they either went three to four or five to six. So this is actually five to six. So this could be. A bit long but I think with leggings it doesn't really matter and just roll the sleeves up um, or they can keep it up for next year but maybe they'll use it with um, black leggings more of um, a longish top like, um, stroke dress um, this was £2.50 and it's just a girly skeleton with the pink hearts and the glitter so I think that is really sweet I've got her the dress which is already had so yeah um, this isn't actually for a granddaughter but you might have seen again previously I bought some more of these ties and there's um, one two three four it looks like about six I think in this pack does it say six and I think this is better value than the other one and it's those ones that are like um, elasticated tie things these got butterflies on in all different colors a better value than the last lot actually and I can always it's only loosely tied so it can be altered for those little books um, this item I believe looking at the receipt was £1.50 is Disney Princess and she's having a desk for her 
for her Christmas actually, because she's got birthday and Christmas. She's having a bike, I think, for her birthday um, as her main present. And I think she's got a desk and um, stall for Christmas. So um, I'm buying her a lot of um, pieces to go with her desk for Christmas as well. So it's the two sort of folders. This is Princess Range, as I said. I believe this was actually £1.50. Um, this item, three pencils with the three erasers, that was a pound, again, Disney's, Disney Princess, that's her this phone, and I got her some washi tape, she loves my washi tape, so I've got a few reels that I'm not precious about that she plays with, and this is in the Princess range as well, I don't know if that's very clear what they look like, but I thought she's got some things for her desk, um, these are to keep up, um, these are the Smarties, so, and they were pound, and then I did buy, normally my family like the mint ones, but this is the strawberry cream, and that's three bars for a pound. And the last item, I'm not sure if I've seen this or not, whether we actually got it, I don't think we've got it on Blu-ray, but a Sunclex Blu-ray, so I'll probably keep this up for Christmas. This is the um, fantastic... Um, Four, but it's the the latest one um, although it's not that recent now um, but I think it um, is the next generation one so I've got that on Blu-ray because uh, Sun's collecting all the DC and Marvel on Blu-ray so I think that concludes the part of Poundland and I've just got two items from the range and <laughs> and I'm not kidding you it was gonks everywhere as you've probably seen from the footage I don't know if the footage will be in this video or separate but I did pick up two um, gonks the first one was 199 and it's on this little um, sort of spring hook but I think for the price it's still really good and I got it neutral and as long as I have it in my cubby I'm okay you might just see no one there that's going no it isn't and as i say that's the one on the um chain you did probably see some footage of the large one and i mean <laughs> like that. i wouldn't have purchased it so i i know you won't want to the next one i thought was pretty good value actually is this one it was 2.99 which i didn't think was too bad on the stand and i'm gonna have this one in my cubby because of the pink and the white I think it's just absolutely gorgeous in fact you'll probably find this will probably go straight in there I know it's Christmas um, related but there you are I don't think it matters does it um, I must admit when I was filming I went specifically for Halloween again um, very disappointed I think it's again I've mentioned this before I think stores are mostly concentrating on stock they already have and they seem to be going straight into Christmas um, normally home scents are brilliant for um, decorations and I had a couple of things on my mind that was hoping I would come across and didn't they didn't have the displays don't think they're even going to bother this year they had about half if not maybe a whole um, sort of um, shelving thing of Halloween and that was it as normally they have about three or four um, rows plus all the window displays are normally Halloween this time of year but it seems they've gone straight in for Christmas has the range have as well and when I spoke to an assistant in the range basically they put what Halloween's merchandise they had and two days later they were moving it and putting in Christmas so there you are so I think that concludes this part of my haul again I'm not sure if they're going to come through separate or together but if not they'll be following one another so hopefully you've enjoyed this video thanks for watching goodbye